Hello everyone, today we will be dis discussing an important aspect of drone operations, weight balance, and the various performance factors that affect small unmanned aerial systems or SUAS. Understanding these elements is critical for safe and effective drone flights. Our objective today are twofold. First, we define the weight and balance in relation to SUAS operations. And second, to analyze some uncontrollable performance factors that can influence flight. Let's start with weight and balance. Proper weight distribution is critical to ensure that drone functions as expected. Always consult the manufacturer's documentation to confirm the limits of weight and balance for your particular drone model. Failure to do so can result in performance issues. FAA mandates compliance with weight and balance limits to ensure flight safety. If your SUAS is loaded incorrectly, it may behave unpredictably, which could lead to accidents or malfunctions. It's not just about getting your drone off the ground, it's about ensuring stable and controlled flight throughout. Before each flight, it's important to ensure that the drone is properly loaded. This includes verifying that your weight is evenly distributed and that the drone appears balanced and not leaning. Also, don't forget to review any manufacturer limitations or restrictions that may affect your flight. Adding payload to the drone can significantly impact its performance. It's essential to calculate how additional weight will affect flight dynamics. If you're releasing a payload mid-flight, such as a certain delivery or agricultural operation, you need to plan ahead for the landing weight. What happens if there is no manufactured data for SUAS? In these cases, you must rely on general weight balance principles to make sure you have safe estimates. The most important rule is to distribute the weight evenly, ensuring that the center of gravity is in the correct location for a stable flight. The center of gravity, or CG, is the point where the drone would balance if suspended. The point shifts depending on how the drone is loaded. For a fixed-wing drone, for example, the center of gravity center of gravity is critical or may vary depending on specific design of the aircraft. If you exceed the weight and balance limit of your drone, you could face serious issues. It could, can reduce the effectiveness of your flight controls, causing instability and potential loss of control. Always be mindful of these limits when loading your SUAS. Now let's move to some uncontrolled performance factors. Beyond weight and balance, critical environmental conditions also play a role in the role in flight performance. One key factor is density altitude, which is affected by altitude, air pressure, temperature, and humidity. When you fly at higher altitudes or in conditions with higher temperatures and humidity, the air becomes less dense. This can reduce the efficiency of the drone's propellers, requiring more power to maintain altitude and stability. Finally, the performance impact of excess weight includes reduced climb rate, lower maximum altitude, shorter flight endurance, and reduced maneuverability. These are all critical factors to consider when loading your SUAS. Thank you for your attention today. By understanding these principles, you'll be able to better, be better equipped to safely and effectively operate your SUAS under various conditions.